the final day of the Challenge Tours Curse and Razor the Limpopo Championship, as the Euphoria Golf Club helpers worked hard to get the course into top condition. The final group made their final preparations to see who could be victorious in this, the first of three consecutive events in South Africa. Brandon Stone boasts bags of quality and would have been considered one of the pre-tournament favourites. He got off to a slow start on day one, but back-to-back -back three unders made sure he was in the hunt come Sunday. This creative approach to the par 5 knife showing why Stone is such a threat. He would roll home the eagle putt and end the front nine on minus four. Oliver Becker, here on the par three sixth, he would set himself up for a birdie attempt with this tee shot. The birdie put is good and the South African plays the front nine two under. Nine consecutive pars in the back nine would be good enough for eight under overall, would this be enough to clinch it? Henny Duplessis starting the day four shots back in a tie for ten. He might rue a double bogey at the par five third which he had birdied in the first three rounds. The birdie here at the 18th helped him to eight under alongside Becker and eventually Brandon Stone. The leader heading into the final round, Daniel Van Tonda would not be able to take advantage of his strong position. A pressure birdie put here at the 18th to get back to level par and he stays on minus eight alongside his three compatriots. It's back to the tee for a four-man playoff. On the first extra hole, Duplessis, Van Tonda and Becker would all make par, leaving the door open for Stone to convert a birdie chance and take home the title. No mistake, Stone holds it for birdie and on the first playoff hole becomes the 2021 Limpopo Championship champion. The final leaderboard, Scotland's Craig Howie and Australia's Dayan Lawson play their way into the top 10 with solid final rounds on a day dominated by the home talent. Congratulations to Brandon Stone, he'll be looking to go back to back as the Challenge Tour moves on to Cape Town and the Baines Whiskey Cape Town Open.